Alright, so this is a video I thought I'd do. I told you I'd do it in my last video, I think. Um, it is um, a video on my Halloween costume, but it is also very useful in a situation where there is um, a chemical that is dangerous. Um, so, as you know, the part of my costume is this Israeli gas mask. Here's the filter. And, um, the last hazmat suit that I got was, one, not real, which made me very angry, and two, the zipper broke off when I was trying to zip it up. I tried to fix it, but then when I tried to do a technique that was where you get some pliers and you, like, um, uh, put the zipper, like, you bend it a little bit, and then the zipper broke, so I left a bad review on Amazon for that. So, I, uh, ordered... A real hazmat suit. I've never gotten a real one of these before, but I'm gonna go get a pair of gloves real fast and show you what my Halloween costume will be like. So I got some vinyl gloves right here. Now I'm going to try on the hazmat suit, see how it fits, it has a tag in it, I wonder if I can tear this out, yep, I can tear it out, um, so, that's the sleeve, it's very long, I'm scared about that, alright, so right now I'm going to put it, I'm putting on the hazmat suit, and hoping that it will fit. these hazmat suits is they have that elastic band around the ankles and the wrists that will like help it stick does it have one of those things in it that keep it like right there on your wrist I don't think it does okay so I put it on it's a little bit too big but okay that means I can wear it for a couple of years Next year, I'm going to get a GP5 gas mask with a hose and just slap this baby back on. Okay, so it's a little bit bulky, but that's okay. Uh, it's a hazmat suit. That's what I was looking for for my costume. But the thing is, I don't know if I'm going to put the Israeli gas mask on under the hood or on the outside of it. So the hood the hood goes on like that. I look like... <laughs> I look kind of weird... I'm going to direct this a little bit down so you can see. This is what it looks like on me. Oh, that was a bunch of air came up. This thing practically breathes. That's how much air comes in and out of it. Okay, so this is uh, my first real hazmat suit that I've gotten. And I believe I'm going to get the... I believe I'm going to get the Israeli gas mask and put it on the outside of this. Oh, crap. Ugh. I hate it when that happened. Uh -huh. There we go. Okay. I can't wear it like that because air leaks in through the sides. I noticed that because I heard a lot of when I breathed in. So, I'm going to see if this looks stupid or not when I put it on like this. So, um, 
This doesn't look too bad. Um, I'm going to attach the filter now and see what it looks like. Okay, so Okay, so it makes an airtight seal. I'm gonna wear some gloves with it. I'm gonna just get these on. I um so yeah, that's what I'm gonna wear. I'm also gonna wear some boots. And uh this will look legit. I guess if legit has another name, then I don't know what this is. Um, so, first vinyl blunt is on. Oh, I hate it when that happens. Well, I'm gonna get the other blunt. There we go. Now we're going to get this glove on. Okay, so I have the um, gloves on with the hazmat suit. I am not going to like to put on the boots because they will track dirt on the carpet from last winter. But, um, I don't know how I'm going to make it look like I have a distillator, but I guess I'll just deal with it. Um, the only problem with this is if it were a movie, then it'd be a little bit messed up because this is a civilian mask, which means that civilians only will wear it, not like industrial I'm well, not like personnel. I'm gonna take off the mask so you can hear me better. I think that my mask broke. That's gonna make me mad if it did. And phew. I think it did not break. Phew. Thought it broke for a second. And I would have freaked out if it broke okay so um like i said um the only problem is this is a civilian mask and um personnel will wear probably like a gp5 gas mask or something um but other than that this is a pretty good hazmat suit um it's kind of a coincidence that I had these gloves with me because they will work. Well, I'm going to get this off because I'm sweating in it because I just took a shower. Because I had a football game, even though it's Sunday, which is weird. Uh, okay, so. It's like a tarp material. It's not, it's more of like plasticky tarp, kind of nylon polymer. Like, I don't know. But either way. Give me a second. Let me just take this off real fast. But, yes, yeah, so like I said, the, um, the gas mask that I do have is a civilian gas mask. Um, so, it's, I, um, my, my, um, my grandmothers, well, they asked me, they asked me, hey, what do you want for your birthday? And I said, oh, there's some gas masks on my Amazon wish list. And they said, why do you want to get, have a gas mask? And I'm like, because they're cool, and I want to collect them. And they're just like, I don't know why I'm, okay. <laughs> and they're, so, I hope I hopefully can get um, this GP5 gas mask. The only problem is, it's a cosplay mask. So, it's, it's a model. The filter is going to be exceedingly useless, but I'm going to test it anyway. My, um, my family doesn't appreciate it, though, when I test my gas masks. So, I'm going to find some aerosol can spray and then I'm gonna test my Israeli gas mask and uh yeah that's really it but um other than
than that, I hope that you all will have a good night, morning, lunch, whatever time it is. I'm uploading this at night, as you can see. You probably can't see. You're reflecting off of the window. I just carry around this laptop. Hang on a second. As you can see, it is mid-dusk. Well, no, it's the end of dusk. I'm not going to show you in the direction of the TV because we're watching Baywatch. The, the old type. Okay, so I hope, like I said, I hope that you all have a good day, night, time, whatever time it is. But, um, I'm out of here, peeps. Bye-bye. I said bye-bye and my clicker wasn't even... Bye.